Flying to the moon is the stuff of childhood dreams, but if you're keen to take your taste buds on a cosmic adventure, follow me. Restaurant Moon in Darlinghurst features a menu that's out of this world. Oh, wow, what an entrance, Chef. How are you, Om? Um? I'm good, thank you. Tell us a little bit about Restaurant Moon. Yes, the moon is good meaning for the Asian people. Yep. And it's my family name as well. Great. Well, I always wanted to be an astronaut as a kid, but I think this is the closest I'm going to get to being on the moon. What have we got here? This looks amazing, Chef. Yeah, this is a scallop. The liquid nitrogen adds some drama and cools the dish. <clears throat> that is delicious. That is so good, Om. And there's more incredible dishes on Moon's menu. All right, Om, I actually have no idea what is going on in front of me right here. What is this? It's just steam egg in the eggshell with a fish sock and uh, on top with a fish roll. I have absolutely no idea how to tackle this. What do you do? Let me show you. OK. Easy. Little spoon. Just break the bubble. Yep. Like that. Oh. <laughs> Do it again, again. This is a GI. Right. Is this yeah. a real one? Yes, a real one. Oh. <laughs> okay. Yep. Yeah, and then just eat the thing inside. Lucky, it's a dish worth waiting for. I thought my poached eggs were good. This is amazing. <laughs> Each dish is delicately crafted, like the braised baby octopus with red peppers and squid ink, or the eggplant tempura with amoebe prawn and spicy miso. And dessert, well, it's another Booty's Delight, with strawberry compote encased in a matcha mousse egg. Moon is an incredible restaurant, but it's also a bar. Phoebe, what is that? Go to Black Moon. Black Moon. All right, taking a trip to the dark side of the moon. Mm. Sensational. Well, from the food to the drinks, Moon Restaurant is a dining experience like no other. And I guarantee you'll be over the moon. When it comes to great food, first it hits the taste buds, then the stomach, and finally, the soul. Soul Dining in Surrey Hills is paving the way in fusion Korean cuisine. Now, Ella, this place is your baby with your husband, who is the head chef, Darrow. Mm -hmm. Tell us a little bit about Soul Dining. Yes, we are a contemporary Korean restaurant. We call it contemporary because this is how the chefs in Seoul right now cooks Korean food. Yep. And we like to say that it's a Korean-Australian restaurant in some ways because we try to get the best of Korea and the best of Australia together in yep. this restaurant. Brilliant. A bit yep. different to the Korean barbecues. Very different yeah. to the Korean barbecues. What have we got going on here? This looks amazing. Yes, this is one of our signature dishes, kingfish and kimchi water. In Korea, what we do is we eat raw fish with a little bit of soybean paste and a little bit of acidity to it. Oh, wow. That is amazing. There's a lot going on in my mouth at the moment. That is incredible, Ila. This is our uh, Wagyu beef tata. Yep. It comes with seaweed cracking that we make in-house. And the Wagyu tata is seasoned with bulgogi dressing. Comes with egg yolk and um, pickle single pear. So then I ask you to take the spoon and yep. put it a little bit onto your seaweed. Okay. And eat it together. Straight like in. A, yeah, like a little finger food. Oh, that crackle. That's amazing. That is just melting. There's one dish that I do recognise. All right, Ella, is this traditional KFC Korean fried chicken? Yes, it's Korean fried chicken. We do it, again, with a little bit of twist yep. to it. It's basically the chicken without any batter and then deep fried. Yep. And then we put the classic chilli glaze sauce on top of it. That chilli's there, but it's not killing the dish. That's, it's a nice bite, but it's that orange just really bang, cuts through, doesn't it? And there's more bang for your buck with fusion dishes like the burrata with heirloom tomatoes and red kimchi dressing. And one of my faves, oh, the lamb rump or lambwich in a potato bun. So next time you're up for Korean, skip the barbecue and head straight to the fusion.